Hello Jelly Babes, welcome back to my channel. So I absolutely love how this sort of winter uh, snowman uh, design has turned out and I achieved this by using some of She Modern's products that were very kindly sent to me for review. All details and links will be in the description box as always. So these are the foil arts that I have used today. So it's got a gorgeous wintry theme. And I'm also going to be reviewing and swatching these pearlescent powders. Um, there are five in total. I think there is more colours that you can pick from as well. Here's just a quick sneak peek of the colours that I'll be swatching. And you sort of always get like a random foil art thrown in as well. Which I always think is really nice. And that's a really gorgeous uh, mixed sort of nail art foil design going on there. So these are the bases that I'm going to be using for these... Um, pearlescent powders and these are the base uh, sorry the gel polishes that i'm going to be using also so these are from kiki london and the names of these polishes are on screen right now so i'm going to be starting off with this gorgeous gold pearlescent shimmer so i'm just going to decant some of this now onto this um plastic um sort of like sheet so you want to get like your pigment um brush so i'm going to be using divine by natasha lee's absolutely loving these products and using them at the moment they're just really good quality so i'm showing you how you can do this and you can apply it obviously using a brush you can just dab it onto the nail directly and rub it in that way with your fingertip if you want to i'll be showing you that later on but i mean this is such a gorgeous gorgeous warm color you know it'd be lovely sort of autumn time I just love that sort of like bright gold like shimmer that goes through it. So I'm just going to finish it off now and just sort of make sure that the uh, polish is all lying flat and all sort of rubbed in before I go ahead and apply the top coat. So I'm going to do uh, the other polishes, sorry, the other powders off camera as well. Um, but I will be showing you the end result. But I'm also followed the same steps that I'm showing you or have showed you <laughs> uh, already in this video. So this is the white pearlescent shimmer, which is really gorgeous. It kind of has like a mother of pearl feel to it. Then this is the green one, which again is always really nice. I do love the pearlescent look. This is a gorgeous shade of pink like almost like baby pink and this one is absolutely stunning i really love it especially with a glossy top coat so here they are all together and i did also go ahead and apply um a, a matte top coat as well so this is how it looks with a matte top coat just in case you were wondering i think it looks gorgeous either way so moving into the design now, so I've gone ahead and applied a white gel top coat, uh, sorry, gel polish. And then like I say, and you can just dab it directly onto the nail like I'm doing and then just rub it in. If you don't want to get your nails all dirty, then you can wear gloves like I'm, I'm doing in this video. If your gel polish doesn't particularly have a very good um, tacky layer as well, you can apply some transfer foil before doing this step and that will like, you know, simulate a gel polish tacky layer. So I'm just going to go ahead and top coat this to make sure it's all sealed in before I get down to doing the foil art. So obviously I've already showed you this, but I'm just going to open it up now. This is what you receive in this package. So you get some like black backing and, uh, you know, like a protective seal over this. And just move that over the top. So I like the fact that you can apply this like a water decal, but it's got like a foil look, if that makes sense. It just makes it, I just think it's easier to use and obviously less likely that you're going to have patches where, you know, sometimes the foil doesn't stick quite as good as it should have. So you just want to cut out the uh, foil arts that you'll be using in, in the money. So that's what I'm going to be doing here. And then you want to trim off as much excess um, sort of like backing paper as possible it will just help uh, not show up so much on the nail if that makes any sense like the edges of the water decal then you want to just get like a little container I'm actually just using like a glitter tray and just put a little bit of water and you don't need loads 
because it pretty much separates um, you know a few seconds after putting it into the water and then you want to get some tweezers I'm going to be using these tweezers from Divine by Natasha Lee it'll just help you get it out and position it on the nail much easier so I'm just going to place it there I'm not placing it right at the bottom of the nail just because obviously I'm going to be adding the sort of snow at the bottom of the nail so once you've got it in position you want to get some cotton wool or kitchen towel and just get rid of that excess um, water just so then it will stick on the nail like so and then i'm just going to add the other decals to the other nails which are just going to be a mixture of sizes of these um sort of foil snowflakes Like I say, just get it in position and then get rid of that excess um, water. Then you want to seal this in with a, a gel top coat. If you're using a regular top coat, you're going to need to use a water-based one so the foils don't um, sort of crack. So that's how it looks. You could keep it like that if you want to, but I just wanted to add that little bit of extra sort of bling to the nail. And that's why I've um, sort of used the sugar technique and we'll be applying glitter over the, the top of this. So you just want to take a striping brush and obviously sort of line out where you want the snow to be. You can apply it quite thickly because obviously you're going to be, um, you know, putting sprinkling the glitter over the top of this. So you don't cure this yet because um, obviously the glitter needs to stick to the wet gel polish. So I'm just adding some extra details really and then I'm just going to get a dotting tool and then add like obviously the, uh, you know, the falling snow kind of look. So this is the glitter that I'm going to be using. So it's Divine by Natasha Lee. So it's a gorgeous white glitter and it's an iridescent glitter and it's called Opal. You want to have a glitter tray underneath you to catch the falling glitter so obviously you can scoop that back into the pot so you're not wasting loads and loads of glitter. So you just want to sprinkle it all over the wet polish, tap off any excess and put that straight into your lamp and cure it. Once you have cured it you want to get a brush and then you can wipe off that excess glitter and then what happens is the glitter is obviously just stuck to the wet polish and nowhere else and you kind of get like a, a 3D sparkly look. that's what you can see now and obviously I've just added some snow to the other nails so here is the reveal I really really love how this has turned out I hope that you like it too jelly babes it's a gorgeous sort of sp uh, sparkly winter wonderland nail design so thank you so much for watching thank you she modern for sending me these products and um, make sure you click that free subscribe button and take care and I'll see you in the next